Hi, Mr. X with Glossary Term Rolle's Theorem. In calculus, when we have a smooth, continuous, differentiable function, and we have the same output values, if y is a function of x, then we have the same y values for two different elements from our domain. Then Rolle's Theorem says that if the function between those two points is smooth and continuous, there has to be a point between those two, where the derivative of the function is zero. All right, well, let's assume we have our standard x versus y graph, and we're going to say y is a function of x, because that's what we usually do to keep things straight. And I just pick this particular level of y. The output from this part of the domain is this value of y. From this part of the domain is this value of y. And from this part of the domain is also this value of y. In other words, this is a horizontal line. If this function is smooth and continuous and differentiable, then between two points with the same output, there has to be at least one other point where the derivative of the function is zero. And that would be a maximum in this case, right about there. The derivative there would be 0. And between this point and this point, turns out, we get a minimum where the derivative is 0. Sure, the derivative is the slope of the tangent. Rolle's theorem. Learn the language of mathematics at mrxmath.com.